So if you've decided to quit your day job and go all in on what you love, create. You come up with what you think is a million dollar idea and you know it's going to hit a home run. You're going to get discovered and you'll finally make a career based on your creativity. The only problem for you is that you want to create perfection and nothing you create is ever good enough. So you turn into a big baby and get frustrated. You waste tons of ink and tons of paper and even more paper. You overwork yourself to the point that you don't even care how many trees you just killed because you've become a loser. I quit like a few months ago, man. Oh, come I, I... on, man. You can't be making any real money from your cartoons, right? They're superheroes, man. They're not cartoons. You can call me back at Christmas when you need a job. Okay, you'll be back. You'll always come back. Where you get the money? Two people with you are renting. Uh, but no, you can't go to the high cost of restaurant to eat in a McDonald's. I don't think you have a few meals a day. Maybe I can send some food for you from my airplane, okay? How is that? Don't forget. Go to church every Sunday. Don't forget. Okay? Don't worry. I know what I'm doing. You realize that the ones that love you are not necessarily rooting for you at all. The only person you can root on is yourself. So you work all day and night for days, weeks, months, and even years. You do it because you love it. Eventually, your hard work pays off and you land the biggest pitch that will change your life. Where's your suit? I, I, forgot my, I forgot my suit. The guy who pitched us Guardians of the Galaxy was in a suit. James Gunn. Yeah, I could just take him home with me and dominate his sweet little... So the kid doesn't have a suit. What's the big deal? Let's just listen to what he has to say. Okay, kid. Show us what you got. All right. What if social media was a superhero? All right, you with me? You with me? Okay, so we got YouTube Man. He's based on the platform. He's armed with a play shield. He throws ads in front of his enemies and gets them stuck for 30 seconds. But it looks like Captain America, just in red and white. I love it. Very original. John Favreau, didn't he wear a suit? And he still comes over to my place and makes me grilled cheese. Okay. The Facebook man. He's got a book that smashes people in the face. And you see this cape? This cape is bulletproof because I call it the wall. What makes Facebook man so powerful? He's got a lot of data. Oh, he doesn't give his enemies any privacy. Reminds me of Batman. Or the offspring of Batman and Captain America. Snapchat man. We all know the logo, it's a ghost, so we make him invisible. You know, he sneaks into the bad guy's house, takes them out with strawberries or turning into a, a cute puppy, smacks you with a rainbow tongue, because you know, that, that tongue thing, you know, it's nothing sexual. Have you even used Snapchat? No, but I have an account. He looks like Two Punch Man. Okay. Instagram Man. This guy slides in with DM throwing stars armed with a boomerang shaped like the infinity symbol. If you get hit by that flash, you're kind of going back and forth and you're stuck in like a, a trance going back and forth like the, like the boomerang in the story time thing, get it? This looks like a purple ninja turtle. So what about Twitter man? Bad news fuels his jetpack up the yin yang. He's up in the sky, he drops 280 blue bird explosions on your ass. Boom! We just call that the retweet. I call this team the followers. The social media superhero team, Marvel's newest, everyone's gonna love it. Can you just imagine Avengers collaboration, Black Panther, Spider-Man? It's gonna be a hit. Have you received a release for any of these logos? No, but we can contact the brand. They're never gonna let you use their logos. Twitter guy is a ripoff of our Falcon. Why are all of these characters male? I'm not good at drawing women. My child draws better. I'd rather stick my hand in a blender than see this get made. And could you have made this suck more? What are you trying to do, to be discovered? I can't take this anymore. Every time there's an Asian guy trying to pitch his project, you overreact. He's poured his heart out. Why is there no Asian guy Winnie and Marvel. The Filipino kid from Spider-Man. He don't count. 
There's Donnie Yen and Kelly Tran. They don't count. We are not Star Wars. We are Marvel. Is there Asian superheroes? Uh, I was gonna make two Asians, a black guy and a white guy, and probably a mix. Three Asians! See, he's kind of figured out. My vote is yes. This is genius, Milton. I still say no. That's a no for me. That's a no for me too, sweetie. Thanks for your time though, guys. Oh, oh, oh. Down the street, the zoo store. Yeah. He should've worn a suit. So you want to give up and cry the rest of your life. Going back to your day job and telling your coworkers, friends, and family that they were right. But you can't quit. This is your life, not theirs. You start to remember your early years of creating. That kid was a badass, his own hero with ambitions, goals, and dreams. You start to remember why and realize that you must harness your inner child's imagination because he created one with no boundaries. Do you really want to quit now and have a lifetime of pain? Maybe you haven't thought outside the box enough. Or maybe they were meant for something bigger. We're outside Best Buy right now where police has informed us that a man who goes by the name of Hater has stolen all the routers and modems in every Best Buy in the city. We don't know if he works alone or in a team or what the purpose of stealing these items are, but we'll continue to update you as soon as information becomes available. Load those routers quickly, we got a lot of work to do tonight. No more Wi-Fi means no more internet access, which means no more influencers. People still have access to the data plans on the cell phones though, so won't we have to destroy those too? Even those with 10 gigabytes of data won't make it to the second week. <laughs> Stop right there! Stop! I'm just getting started. It's time for a new world order. Every hero needs a hater. Hey everybody, thank you so much for watching the first episode of Followers, a 10 part web series that's gonna be launched on this channel. If you guys haven't subscribed already, please do so now. Make sure you hit those bell notifications and we're gonna release all new episodes every week. So make sure you guys check out the second episode. Until then, happy creating. Yeah.